Well, school has officially started back, or as I like to call it, Pokemon Rehab. It's that glorious time of year when we get to give the kids back to the Department of Education for the next nine months while Mama and me can get back to priorities like day boozing and skyrockets in flight. Boo! Yeah, most of you won't get that. But seriously, hallelujah, Jesus is alive and the kids are back in school. But quite honestly, I'm concerned with my kids' emotional well-being and I'm going to tell you why. Have you seen these teachers that are forced to stand in the drop-off and pick-up lanes? Don't let that sweet gal from Meet the Teacher Night fool you. Have you seen the way they act when they're directing traffic every morning and afternoon? They look more pissed off than a pit bull that would just serve rice cakes for dinner. Arms flailing, telling you where to stop, where to go, and where to be. Flopping around like Michael Phelps out of water. You're trying to get the kids unloaded, and they're pointing at you like you're a suspect in a lineup. Where do you think the angst that is built up inside of them is going to be unleashed? I'll tell you where on your third grader in homeroom. Look, teach, I know you're pissed off because you've been enjoying Wine Wednesdays all summer long, and now you got to go back to using your fancy book learning and molding little minds and putting up with parents and administrators and everybody else. But ease up on the road rage. Look, I've already been driving a car for 20 years when you were in a sorority and majoring in undecided. So I got this. Parents, remember when you could just pull up to the curb, open the back door, and yell, Run, Forrest! Without the guilt, or make them walk that last mile and a half, directing me to a specific lane and telling me where to stop. I pull into my own driveway on two wheels. Listen, I've had these kids full-time, non-stop for the last three months. You think I'm going to slow down to let them out? Do you know what I had to go through at 6.30 this morning just to get them to you? Bye, Felicia. But seriously, thank you, teachers, for all that you do. Because we really don't want to. And folks, slow down in the school zones and put your cell phones away. Love y'all. God bless. Here's Facebook poke. Owen, oh, while you're directing traffic, namaste.